I fluffed that up totally. That's all right, man. So I'll start again. We have sold seven sets of the. Hi, and welcome back to M's Den. We're Paul and Marie, and today we've got a bit of a sales update. We have, yes, April. We thought we'd cover cover April. April. Yes, I know it's almost the end of May, and we seem still behind. Well, it's, but we're catching up, aren't we? We are catching, we're up, catching up slowly, but uh, you know we're getting there. Yes, we make these videos showing what um, what we're putting something up for. We always check yeah. solds to try and get an accurate price of what we want to put something up for. Yeah. Because when we list it, our aim is to sell it. Oh, yeah, yeah, We definitely. don't want to just house it for months on end. We are aiming to sell as much as we can. So we list something based on the price of solds. But what do we actually get for it? So we do think, as resellers, it's important to show you that yeah. not everything goes for full price. Um, some things you have to be flexible, you have to take offers, you have to have things like sales. We have all to, have fails. Yes, you have to keep you know shifting I mean? so the you stuff, to, don't you? Yeah, that's it. So you it's have to be quite good. active in that department. Yeah, but yeah. I thought this week, <clears> hun, <throat> just to um, make it a little bit more exciting, we'd play the game of guess how many full price items we have. Okay. So we have a, we're going to do a, what sold our best sale of the month or our favourite sale of the month. Yeah. We're also going to have 18 items that I've picked randomly through the month. How many of those 18 do you think have sold for full price? Play along if you want. Mm. 18 items. Well, generally, uh, we take a lot of offers. We do. <coughs> it's two of I'm us. We do say... need, um, you know. It's got to be either, uh, I reckon two or three um you've got to give me a definite answer there oh i'm gonna go two two okay so if you're if you haven't won i'm i'm gonna say <laughs> oh hang on you can't guess you've done the work <laughs> okay but if you haven't got it Excuse right me. i think you should be doing dinner <laughs> oh really if i haven't got it right. That's sort of now. That's sort of telling me now that I haven't got it. Oh, right. I don't know. Or am I double bluffing? Could mm. be double bluffing. So should we get on with it then and show you? <laughs> you guess along. See how many out of eighteen items. How many do you think have gone for full the price? The phone's just over there. I could use the phone to get dinner sorted. We we <laughs> we're resellers. We can't afford takeaways. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice though? Nice Chinese. No. Anyway, we can't do that. So should we should we go through what we've sold? Yes. I'm turning the page then. You're turning the page. And you can start with the old favourite sale of the month, hum. Sale of the month. Mm -hmm. Wow. So what we got here? So we um, sold seven sets of Beanie Babies. Seven no, sets. No, Beano Comics. Oh, Beano Comics. Yes, Sorry, I thought it was Beanie Babies. Again, I haven't got my glasses on. Wouldn't that be good, though, if we did sell some of those <laughs> Beanie Babies? babies. That would be amazing. I mean, yeah, it would be amazing. Yeah, I fluffed that up totally. That's all right, man. So I'll start again. We have sold <laughs> seven sets of the Beano comic bundles. Bundles, yes. And I believe, actually, that was the last lot of the Beano comic. Cleared us out, hon. They we've cleared got, us we've out. We've got Dandy left. Yes, we have got Dandy. But we, we yeah. Clear this out the Beano ones. That's fantastic. We got fifty-eight pounds and seventy pence. So I had a hair on my hand. It was driving. Me. <laughs> I was trying to subtly get rid of it, but it was driving me a little bit crazy. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, I don't, I can't remember what they were listed for, but um, but yeah, there, there would have been a, an offer. Um, I believe it. Um, we had a deal going on where it was um, buy two or more and you get something like 20%, 25% off, something like yes. that. Yes, and the picture that's going um, up, Hun, shows the classic bundle, what we did when we got them from auction. We bought loads of tray boxes f full of them. They were really, yeah. really cheap. Worked mm. out at 5p per comic. Mm. So we bundled them together and it was still quite a cheap cost. So I, think they, I think most bundles cost about 50p. Yeah. Um, so yes, I've only put one picture up there, hum, because no, so they that's, that's they don't one need of the to bundles. bundles. No, it's no, so seven, it's seven of sets of those, basically. <laughs> yeah, that's it. So now I'm going to move on then, hum, to the wooden African tree of life. Now, some of you may have seen this in a video. We picked it up for six pound. We were very excited because mm. we listed it for a hundred and forty nine ninety nine. It was gorgeous, wasn't it? But it did have it some was. damage. It did. But it was it gorgeous. Did. It was hand carved, mm. um, that sort of African statue. But over time, what we do is we um, every two months we relist <clears throat> we and do chip the price down. Take it down and relist it. Change the title. Move the photos about. Change the photos. And like you say, we just um, um, 
chip away at the price. Yes, we've been very guilty in the past, you know, a few years ago of leaving stuff on leave there, stuff leaving on. it for years and years and it not selling. <laughs> so we are now much more active. Every we two are. months it gets we've relisted. Still got a lot of stuff, but yes, we're still, <laughs> we're still, trying to get we're still getting it. through it. But this is a classic item because it, it originally went up for 149.99 and then recently it had been notched down to 94.99 that's right yeah um but we had an offer for 60 pound mm. and we literally ripped their arm off didn't we mm. <laughs> because as lovely as it was it was not being appreciated being sat on our shelf so yeah. someone has gone to a good home they can look at it and um, enjoy it we only paid six pounds so six I mean, pounds to 60 pound we were fantastic. overjoyed we were we? overjoyed that's it you know you're making you're making profit just accept the offer Yes, it's and massively we different to the 149.99 that we listed it for, but that was based on solds at the time. That doesn't necessarily yeah. mean you're going to get that. That's exactly it. So yeah, you could put it out for that, but you have to chip away. You can't just leave it at that. Yes, um, if we'd have paid 40 pound, then we probably wouldn't have accepted that offer. No, but no. we only paid six. So yeah, that's it. to get 60 pound back, we were mm. more than happy with that. Definitely. So that's right, you so then, my love. Um, that That's says Simba. Simba. I've written it really small again, hun. Sorry about that. Simba plush toy. This was that one with the, the jointed. We, I think we got it in oh, Wales, the jointed right. one. that was a bit mm. unusual. I think it was um, Lion King the Musical or something like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, it's um, it's quite cool, that. Mm. Um, yeah, we paid three ninety nine for it and listed it for nineteen ninety nine, And um, that would have been an offer, I would have thought. We sold it for seventeen ninety nine. Yes, it's one of those things, hun, when you're in the chat shop. We don't normally pay almost four pounds no. for a plush we have a bit of a limit with, with plush mm. we're quite tight aren't we yeah but we sort of sensed it was something a bit more a bit special yeah bit because it was yeah. jointed and all this sort of thing yeah that's it anyway i'm going to move on to the vintage bamboo tray this is one of these things hun where you thought i was a little bit crazy buying it because it was broken in several places that oh that's that i remember that <laughs> one. Oh, that was awful <laughs> Awful. And I, I, listed, that for? I listed it for twenty nine ninety nine. <laughs> um, I remember you laughing at the time, oh. um, but it did sell for twenty two pounds. It just goes to show if you've got something a bit old and a bit unique, you can still get quite good money for it. I mean, Marie does absolutely love proving me wrong. And it's to be honest my, with you, it's one of my favourite. It's one of your favourite things, isn't it? <laughs> and um, to you know, turning two pound into twenty two pound of something that looks like it's fallen apart. I just, I still remember your face when I picked and, it up. Uh, you know, I, I thought, what, what, what are you buying that for? <laughs> but we got twenty two pound for it. Home, we got twenty two so, yeah, pounds. It was a good so day, wasn't it? It was, it was a, good a good day. day yeah. I mean, we, how, how long did we have that one? We had that. For oh, we did have. Let's not. Let's gloss over that. One. <laughs> <laughs> let's gloss over the length. Of time we had it for okay it was right. waiting for that right person to come along that's yeah. what it was okay <laughs> right what have i got um a brass wall hanging that was that ginormous oval oh, thing that... that you looked at me in the charity shop as if say so you're not buying that massive <laughs> thing surely i do a lot of that was... <laughs> i look at me thinking where you pick that up it for? was too big to go in a bag i had to walk was, around abergavenny i think it was that lovely Ab yeah. abergavenny place i think so we had a lovely day out there didn't we it was nice yeah. um it was so large i could only carry it under my arm yeah um, but it was I... gorgeous wasn't it it was it was it was very nice yeah but i See, the problem is, is when Marie picks um, things like that up, my first thought is, how am I shipping that? Yeah, um, because it was big. It was a big and, boy, wasn't it? you know, we, we use raw mail a lot, and obviously you have size restrictions with raw mail. So, of course, it was on borderline, whether it would be raw mail or whether it would be um, more of a, like a parcel force or somewhere like that. So, of course, the, the price comes into play a little mm. bit. Um, but, uh, but anyway, I've gone on from one hour. That's all right. <laughs> Um, yeah, so this this wall hanging we paid seven pounds <coughs> fifty for. This is not like us in a charity shop, hun. We don't normally go. <laughs> we, don't. we don't normally pay that much in a charity shop for anything. I know you must have had a good feeling. About I did. Have, it was so big as well. Yeah, yeah. So um, we put it up for forty six pounds and ninety nine pence. And what we actually got was thirty nine pounds. It's not bad, hun. Was it? So again, that's probably an offer. Mm. I, would have I think it would have been. That's um, yeah. So I've got a straw basket here, hun. I've just wondered, I wonder why it was a little bit fuzzy. I haven't got my glasses on. It's a straw basket. Now I've written down one to three. Now if you watch any of our videos, you know that I frequently pick up wicker and straw items. Yeah. I'm 
you know, I'm the wicker woman. A wicker woman. Um, so it's got to be done. Badge? I've got the badge. I've got the badge. Um, so it's got to be done. And um, when I catalogue everything when I get home, I write wicker basket. So when I go through my book, everything says wicker basket. Wicker basket. So it's difficult to pinpoint which one this was. Yeah. So it's apologies for that, but I think it was between the one pound based on the picture of it. I wouldn't have paid a lot for it. Yeah. Um, but it went up for nineteen ninety nine. I know a lot of you are still laughing at that price. Nineteen ninety nine for that. But it did sell for eighteen pounds. So mm. it does sort of show that some of these sort of things you can pick up. 50p or a pound at the boots out and turn them into almost 20 pounds yeah oh yeah so definitely. there you go yeah that's it and uh, i've got some wallpaper Ooh. what wallpaper was this this i think um, this may have been three rolls right yeah the last i'm hoping, the last I'm hoping that's yeah, what okay. the picture yeah <laughs> that's what's in the picture hopefully yeah we paid uh, one pound per roll that's um, sort of our this. thing, isn't it? Unless it's Laura yeah. Ashley, we'll pay a pound. We'll pay a little bit more if it's something like Laura Ashley, but mm. um, but generally a pound a roll. If the pattern looks quite modern, if it nice, looks, and yeah. looks quite desirable, and, yeah, that's yeah. it. Um, they do go quite well with wallpaper. We've found. Um, yeah, they're not always the fastest no, sellers. No, they're not. They're not the fastest. But sellers, they're quite but, bread and butter, aren't they? Yeah, um, we listed this for eighteen ninety nine. Now, if it is the one I'm thinking of, I think that's another one that was, we chipped away at the price. I think might it done, might have done because normally, if, if there's it, three it, rolls, I think we would have gone nearer the thirty pound mark. Yeah, roll. so I think this has been chipped away. So we might have had this one for a little while, um, but again, it does depend on the brand and the pattern. But anyway, so um, eighteen ninety nine, we listed it for, and we got uh, fifteen pounds. It sold for fifteen pounds, but. Even at that, um, if it is the three roll one, so it's three pounds we pay for the wallpaper. Yes, it's not too bad, is and it? Into 15 pounds, not bad. Not too you know, shabby, my not love. Too shabby, too shabby. That's it. So I'm moving on to a hand carved wall hanging. We got this from a chat shop in Hive. It was six pound. We did it about in the shop. Um, it went up for 49.99 because it was gorgeous. I think it was like a Balinese sort of um, sort yeah. of thing. Yes. And, oh, yeah, yeah. And it mm. sold for thirty nine ninety nine. So we were we were more than happy with that rate of return, oh, yes. weren't we? Definitely, definitely. Um, but that would be an offer. That would have been. An offer, I think it was. It? Yeah, yeah, I think it was an yeah. offer. Um, right. What have I got here? Another wicker item. It's a wicker basket. Uh, this was actually given to us from your parents. The lovely parents, thank you very yes, much. Yes, thank you. <laughs> when our van broke down, they gave us some, lots of things, didn't they, to help yeah, us out? Yeah, to help us out, to sell And it did help us out, so thanks very much. Yes, so we, the cost is zero. Um, I know, woo! Funny. We do like those ones. <laughs> um, the listing value for this was nineteen Oh. You never guess what. What, hum? We sold it for full price. Yay! Well, that's not bad then, hun, is it? It's not bad not at all. Not bad at all. So, you won then. You got one so far. One so far. Oh. Mm. So, I'm moving on to the Wattometer. I'm assuming that's how you say <laughs> it. Wattometer. Wattometer. Do you remember? It's that tiny, tiny thing we had yeah. in the backlog, and we were surprised yeah. at how much it was worth when we Can't did the believe. video. Yeah, that's it. Um, we listed it for twenty eight ninety nine. It went overseas for twenty five pound. I think it went overseas, didn't it? Oh yes, I think it did. someone yes. asked. Yeah, I remember that. I think yeah. someone asked about it's like it asking being... about how you know if it's everything's functional. Obviously, with you know with these sorts of things, you do have to do a bit of research and figure out how they work and all this sort of thing and um, the item was so tiny um, trying to figure it out and obviously you can you can see it working through your eye and I was trying to get it on the camera I couldn't mm. um, but um, but yeah no yeah. it all worked fine yeah it went overseas and uh, well, I'll let you carry on sorry oh did I not do the price I don't think so um, I think I might have done what, 20? I'll say it again it was 28.99 and we managed to get 25 pound for it okay they've a bonus there bonus I've revealed it twice sorry <laughs> that's right it's Sorry, your I, turn I, I didn't think you said the sole price. I could be wrong. Oh, it could be. We'll have to watch the video. Have to see <laughs> we are now. Neither see who's right. Neither of us can remember anything, <laughs> even though we only said it a minute ago. So it's your turn now, then, my love. A uh, bamboo cat. Now, do you I've remember got... this was the little? Um... Oh, it's only about was that it, big. Was it the one when that the, opened the, out? Yeah, the yeah. head comes off. Yeah. Um, and again, some of these things. You look at me as if to I say, see "This, this tiny little." Why are you getting that tat? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> But um, yeah, I mean, I I am surprised at some of the prices of this this stuff. But yeah, we had a little bamboo cat, and we paid one pound for it. 
um, which was a bargain, you know. It was. Um, we mm. listed it for twenty one ninety nine. I know. <laughs> People are still laughing. <laughs> But we actually sold it for £17.59. So yeah, there you go. It's, it is crazy when you see these sorts of things. Yeah. And and you can sort of pick... We've picked up two or three in our time, haven't we? Yeah. And they always tend to go. Mm. Um, just because I think they're so like kitsch, aren't they? And retro sort of looking. Yeah, yeah. Um, That's it. So what have I got then, hun? I've got um, a wooden bamboo reed basket. We paid 50p for this, hun. Must have got that. I can't remember where we even got that from. Um, we read basket. Um, yeah. Oh, it's like a. When I say basket, it's more like a bowl. I think. I think we may have got that at um, the boot sale in Wales. Right. It's like a woven basket. Mm. Uh, fruit bowl. Fruit yeah. bowl is probably a better word. Mm. Um, but we sold that. <clears throat> well, we listed it for nine ninety nine. And guess what, hun? What? It sold for nine ninety nine. Fantastic. That's not bad, is it? Mm. Two, you've hit your you've hit your limit now. Any more, any more, you're doing dinner. <laughs> <laughs> so what have you got? Where have you got? Yeah, <laughs> I've, I've cleverly engineered it I so know. you're doing dinner. Have you noticed? You didn't you didn't sort of say until I guessed. <laughs> <Huh. laughs> I know, but that's why so, I've, got, I've got genius written all over me. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so I've got uh, mini wicker furniture. Um, what's this here? This is the the auction. Do you remember we bought this from the auction lot? Now, I have a bit of a, um, I'm going to say disease, where I love to pick up wicker, being mm. a wicker woman. Mm. And this was that lot that I was definitely going to get, no matter what it was going to go yeah. for, because I wanted that mini wicker furniture. Yeah. And it turned out we were really lucky because the other things in the box were worth more than the furniture. <laughs> we had a little, um, is it Shroff? I can never say it like Shrofsky. 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 Cat. Shrofsky cat that went for good money. We also had um, a bit of paperweight that went for good yeah. money. And the thing that I bought the lot for, which I thought was going to fly out, has sat it's around for blooming ages, ages now. Oh. Ages. So, yeah, so I've written that down to show people that um, sometimes you can list something for 49 but you're not going to get that. Mm. Right, so that's what you listed That's it what for. I listed it for many, 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 many months ago. Yeah, so um, £6.50 is the value we... Um, split the lot out. Yeah, we, we split it out, yes, and £6.50 is what that... Um, lot cost us that that sorry that, that furniture bit. yeah and so yeah so again this is one that we've been cutting the price relisting mm. changing things about photos and all sorts uh, and eventually ended up at a listing value of 24.99 uh, and eventually sold at 17.49 now that would have been a sale price yes and um, I am a little bit upset about it hon because <clears throat> it was worth more than that and yeah you know, it's what it's, it is. I mean, I know, but when you get something that's amazing, yeah, you, it is upsetting when it goes for what you consider too cheap. But the problem is, is you've had it for quite a long time. Quite a long time. So this is the sort of yes, it may be worth more money. That's yeah, fine, you've got to find the right buyer. It's worth you? more money to a, a small amount of people. That's this it. Is, this it is, is the problem. It's, so you know, you're better off taking a lower value. You've got your money back. You've got profit, mm. which is, you know, important. And this is sort um, of doll's house furniture. And the problem with doll's house furniture is you've got to have the doll's house to fit the certain yes. sizing. And this was what I'd call oversized doll's house furniture. Yes, it was. It was definitely oversized. I think, it's uh, the sort I think of thing you'd put your might... Barbie doll on. It's not It's yeah. not like doll's house, doll's house sort of. Yeah, I, I, mean? I think this might have been the person that actually um, asked for some measurements on a chair or something like that. So mm. I think they could get a an idea of what what dolls and yeah. whatever could fit so it, it was never going to fly out the door no, because it's a no. it's a bit niche yes but, but you got profit out of it which yeah. is a, you know and important and thing by getting that lot mainly because that was in it we did well with the other bits in the lot so yeah i shouldn't be moaning really but you know when you're like oh you sort of think oh i should have kept it for that price but what would i do with it It'd just sit in a drawer wouldn't it so Anyway, I'll stop sulking and I'll move on <laughs> to this is the Playmobil house. Now, if you saw this in one of our recent videos, we had a house filled up with bits and pieces. We managed to split it into five bundles. So this house and the bits with it only come to a pound, really. Mm. So we listed it for 24 
it went on sale um, and went down to 17.49 in the sale mm. and we accepted an offer for 16 pounds so a, quite a chunk less but it, when you look at it realistically it was quite um, a chunk wasn't it and one pound into 16 pound is still not too bad it's, it's still good and like i said you're still making profit but the thing is um yeah it went on sale like i said down to that price but one pound fifty less and you think oh it's worth just just taking it yeah and that's what we do sometimes sometimes we'll have a sale on but we'll also leave the offer button on because we we actively want to have people making offers because it helps with the algorithm and generates mm. a bit of you know whatever the word's called um <laughs> Uh, activity. Well, activity. Activity. activity that's it I knew it'd come to me um, so yes you know we do uh, um, like to do that just to try and get as much activity as possible that's it we do right what have I got I got some um, Laurel and Hardy photos and um, now I've put pence, pence there because we bought them in an auction lot it must be about four years three four years ago now right I think it was before it all kicked off you know with the oh, pandemic right. and everything it was oh, all right. before that. Okay. All we bought that. a whole job lot of Laurel and Hardy stuff even though we knew nothing about Laurel and Hardy mm. and we did really well with it didn't we we surprised ourselves with what was in the lot how yeah. much we got back from it um, but what we were left with is these photographs and yes I didn't know what to do with them so I just put them on the shelf mm. so they, they sat there for like three or four years mm. um, and then we decided we would put them on auction and they didn't sell did they they didn't sell i think we we gave it a go must have been two or three times i think they, we put them on, they just didn't go so so we thought okay well we'll just put them on a buy it now yeah and um we listed them for uh, 9.99 and guess what Woo. they sell for full price That's not bad then, Hansa 3. Damn it. Da, 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 da. <laughs> so I'm going to move on then, Hun, to the stick puppet that we picked up, I think, when we went to somewhere that was quite expensive. Um, it was around the Cotswoldsy sort of area. I think it was there. Yes. That lovely day uh, we had there. Well, we didn't pick up much, did we? Because we didn't pick up a lot. Quite yeah, expensive. We, we got, yeah, I can't remember... Was it Siren Sister? I think no. it was Siren Sister, yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah. We paid £3 for this stick puppet, and mm. the only reason I really got the, the um, this item was because it had a bit of wicker on it. Yeah. And I thought, oh, that's a bit unusual. And we put it up for twenty-two ninety-nine, and we took an offer, I think, at £16. So that's not bad. That's gone. It's gone quite quick. Yeah. No, that's that's gone pretty quick. And again, yeah, like I say, um, you're making money. Yeah. Accept the offer. That's it. Yeah. Um, and now I've got a, an item here that I think it's the right item that we've had forever. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't think it's as this... long as you think, but oh, I'm no, guessing. Oh no, not really. Um, I'm guessing that I think it's I don't know. I it has been a while. A it has been. It's, was it was in the, it was in the video, so it's only been it was only last year someone that we picked it up. But it oh, seems no, this was charity shop, wasn't it? This was this charity, charity shop. shop. It was at Annie's, wasn't it? That's right. Stoke. Yeah. Um, yeah. We paid two pounds fifty for this. Uh, and again, I, I I do actually th I think, I think we I put might it up have, for thirty quid, didn't we? Yeah, we put it up for more than that, and I think we so. sort of chipped away at the price. So the listing value actually ended up being twenty one ninety nine, and um, we received an offer for twenty pounds, which we accepted. We did, yeah. So I mean, you know, again, two pound fifty to twenty pounds is is not bad at all. Yeah, when we bought it, we were I was quite excited because I thought it was quite rare because mm. there was you don't get many boy what are called boy porcelain dolls. It's mainly no. the girls, isn't it? That's it. And um, um, he was from a specific range. I thought, oh, we're onto a winner here. Put it up for thirty pound and it just sat there. He did. Sat there he looking sat... scary on the shelf for all those months, didn't he? Yeah, I turned it around. <laughs> yeah. No, he didn't have the best <laughs> face to be blessing. No. So it's gone for £20, that's yeah, not bad, is it? that's not bad at all. So then I'm finishing my one then, hun, on the Winnie the Pooh folk art. So this is when we went to Wales again. It was those two wooden Winnie the Pooh, looked like someone had made them by hand. Um, the old vintage wooden oh, yes. shaped yeah. things. Yeah, it takes so me a while, I remember. <laughs> I picked them up, I put them down, I picked them up, I put them down, and then yeah. in the end we just, for £2, just get them. Yeah. So I got them for £2, um, we listed them for twenty two ninety nine, and I think we must have taken an offer for £15. Yes. So we yeah. still made some money, still and they've made gone, some money. That's hopefully it. to a good home. That's it. 
And my last one, I've got a, a vintage bamboo came three tier shelving unit. This was quite a recent purchase when we were with the parents, with a, a morning out with the parents, and we yeah. went to oh, Leon, Leon the Solent, just up the road from us. And um, we were just about to go, and then you, I think you wanted to have a look in the last shop, mm. and I said, oh, I'll go with you. It was windy, wasn't it? I remember that. Yeah, it was very windy. Mm. And we spotted it in the window, Yeah. and it was a bit of an oh no moment. You were like, oh no. <laughs> Bandit. She's seen that through the window. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Um, we paid two pound fifty for it. I know. Which is in a charity not bad shop. For a charity in a shop, charity is it? Shop. You don't, you know, you still, you still get some bargains in the charity shop, but you really got to look. They for them, didn't know you? the value of it. No, that no, was a thing. Definitely not. And um, we listed it for twenty nine ninety nine, and um, went for full price. Woo! Fantastic. That's not bad. Twenty nine ninety nine. I do. That's good. I do love buying bamboo stuff because there is value, and not a lot of people realise that there is value. But yeah, but have a look on sold for bamboo and things like that, and just um, see because you will be shocked um, at the price I of mean, some of those things. Some things are, are fine to package, um, but I do. You know, some of the items can be a bit of a pain. Yeah. But you know, it is worth it with some of the values that you actually get for them. Yeah, um, chunk of money but, we got um, back from that, and, that yeah. and it went quite quickly as well. Yeah, yeah. Because normally the stuff that goes for full price goes within the, the first sort of sort of month. Oh, really, goes, goes it? quick normally. Goes quick. Yeah, yeah. Before definitely. it's had a chance to go on sale or, yeah. or things like that. So, yeah, yeah, normally it would go would go quite quick. Yeah, that's it. So, so in total, yeah. we had four full price items out of that eighteen, and the reason we harp on about this is because you you know if you are. If you are listing stuff, you do sort of, well, we've sort of found that you do have to be a little bit flexible with the price. You do. Um, yeah, Because definitely. if we if we it's... hadn't have taken offers um, or hadn't had a sale, we would only have sold four of those 18 items. That's it. You've got to keep the activity going on eBay and um, adjust your pricing if you feel it's been there for too long. Yeah. You know, get it relisted, adjust your pricing, change your title about. You know what I mean? Just to try and, and, and get it going. That's it. And to be honest, um, there's a few things there that went for a lot less than we would what we would have liked. But some profit is better than no profit. And if it's exactly. sat on our shelf, it's, there's no profit. There's no profit at all. And, you you know, you just get the money in and move it on to something else that you know is, is going to be a quicker seller. That's it. You, you need to get the um, money in to be able to pay ourselves and also buy more stuff. Because that's the that's fun it. bit. Yeah, that's our ultimate shopping, aim is to buy as much as possible. <laughs> that's it, yeah. But we hope yeah. you've enjoyed seeing the sort of things we like. If we show you something in a video, we do like to show you what it actually sells for. Yeah. Because when we do our videos, we go on about the profit, don't we, and how it can fluctuate between. So that's why we do the best case, worst case. Yeah. Just to be it. as accurate as we can, and, and we like to show you that you know you can put something up for one hundred and forty nine ninety nine, but what you actually <laughs> sell it for is sixty pounds. So that is the joys of reselling. It is a joy it's, to resell. It is up and down. It is flexible. You've got to be flexible. It's not always the case as well, though, because we could have listed that um wooden african what was it the tree of, tree, life. tree of life and um someone could have snapped it up really quick it's That's not it. you know if the right person came along at the right time that yeah. may have sold at 150 pounds it was based on sold but, so there were yeah, there was so, evidence of it selling for that sort of those selling yeah. for that sort of price so you and, can't always tell so yeah do aim at your you know highest point really. yes what you want and then for you're it. just you can edge it down um you can never yeah. go up once you can, it's once yeah, you're, you can always come down and yeah. do, sometimes it depends on the time of you know i was gonna say time of the month then that's not a good phrase to use. <laughs> sometimes it can depend because obviously towards the end of the month you might need more money in yeah. to pay yourselves and um you are a little bit more flexible with taking offers you are that's exactly it so yeah so, so that's it really i think we've bored them enough hun with what we've sold yes um yeah if you like these videos do let us know you know pop pop your comment down below yes and um yeah do give us a thumbs up as well and uh, consider subscribing it is free um but yeah so i think we're that's it we're from done. us i think hun isn't it so it thanks is. ever so much for watching yes thank you any pictures going out yeah about 14, I think, my love. Picture Are fest. you touching wood? I am touching wood. <laughs> Are we doing it then? Does my hair look all right? Yeah, it looks good. Well, I was like that. How can you say, <laughs> yeah, it looks good? Oh, because I look at it all the time, hun.
You were spot on. <laughs> spot on my ass. <laughs> right. I wish I could just shrink my boobs down a bit. They're just they're too big, aren't they? Too big. <laughs> the only problem with um, sunny weather is that you have to wear less. You can't cover everything up as much. Anyway, got veering it. off, hon, veering off. You got it, Florian. Yeah. Got too much of it, though, hon. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to hide it. Right. Okay, I might take my slippers off because I've got socks on and my feet are getting a bit... If you take my socks off under the table, get that smooth. <laughs> Perhaps not so smooth. Okay, that's better. I was getting a bit warm there. It's funny, isn't it? How it can suddenly turn from, like... Three layers to a t-shirt, just like that. Tommy yeah, Cooper. It's, it's just like, it's just really like hot, that. Isn't it? Yeah. I've rambled on for a lot longer than I thought there, hun. Was it too yeah. long? Was it too rambly? No. No, nah, they're used to it. <laughs> I, I looked down. Yeah. Yeah. When you started doing the um, pictures. Mm -hmm. And I was, I was looking over and I was thinking... I've got to put all of those <laughs> no, pictures no. up. In my mind, I was thinking, <laughs> my God, how many pictures have I got? No, when I, but no, originally yeah. that was... I know, was I looked at it. Sold, they thought... sold more than I thought. <laughs> 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 We've yeah. learned a bit of information about books. Now when we're out and about, we, we'll be able to look and... Oh, sorry, I'm boring you. Yeah? <laughs> how rude. No, <laughs> I was suppressing a yawn throughout the video. Really, it's worse. I know, but I'm really tired. <laughs> Changes, doesn't it? It's recording now, yeah. All right. Why? Well, she can't see my book at all, that's odd. Oh. <laughs> I, was going, I was going the wrong way. <laughs> what a half wit. <laughs> okay. Yeah, look, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I could be so daft. Okay. Are you ready? I think so, my love. I think so. No. Ah, got a t-shirt on today, my love. Look at that. You're um, far over here. Yeah? Um, yeah, touching wood, touching wood. I've got my socks off, I know. <laughs> I know, it's gone from two jumpers, two, two jumpers to a t-shirt and no socks. That's because having my hair down like this makes me get was. really hot. <laughs> 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 Hi and welcome back to Ends Den, we're Paula Marie. And it's week 50, hun, 50 of our challenge. You're looking at me like I've done something wrong. <laughs> what have I done? Oh, is it meant to be and this is the tent? <laughs> 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 it's not a good start, hun, it's not a good start. Why okay. did you do that last week? Oh, I don't know, my love, I don't know. Perhaps I should have had the coffee before we did the filming. Yeah. Okay, and this is the ten, ten old toys. And ten, ten, no, 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 no. Okay, hold on. Spat it with my own face. <laughs> right. <laughs> How the hell did you do that? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I'm ready, my love. Good luck. I'll, I'll try and get it right this time. Hi, right, welcome back to M's Den. We're Paula Marie. And this is... Paula <laughs> Marie. <laughs> I'm coming too early. <laughs> oh, goodness me. Right. Come on. <laughs> I wonder if I've got some sort of asthma thing going on because I've, <laughs> out of I finally get out of breath <coughs> halfway through the sentence. That's not good, is it? Didn't used to be like that, did it? No. Not taking okay. a deep enough breath, I think, initially. <gasps> Try and, I was just going to say about your hand. Um, Have I got crazy hands again? No, no, no. No, the, uh, you haven't. I was just, just being conscious of it because obviously last week... It, no, 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 you don't have to... You can move them. I'm just last saying. Last week I had the pen and I was orchestrating. <laughs> To do is tape them down. It's trying to not do that as well. My thumbs, I'm a bit yeah, thumb it's, crazy. It's not too bad. It's not too bad if I have them, <coughs> if I have them together, like, like I'm praying. Yeah. Okay, we're doing them. I'm going to start then. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the way you announced it. I, I felt I needed I'm a ooh. <laughs> okay. Then. All right. Good afternoon. I hope everybody is well. Are you well, dear? I am, but it's only morning. <laughs> You've thrown me a bit there. It's right. morning, isn't it? Start again. When the video comes out, it'll be oh, two o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's morning now, yes. <laughs> I'm thinking of when people will be watching it. I was thinking, <laughs> I was thinking you'd got a bit crazy. 
<laughs> it threw me a bit because I was thinking, but it's not what it's not afternoon. You're right, it will be afternoon. Okay, okay. I'll try and get with the plan, hum. Okay. <laughs> Good afternoon. <laughs> I was thinking it's like half ten in the morning. Oh, okay, okay. I'll try and be, you know, switched on a bit. Ching. What did I do that for? You're wishing, that's what you're doing. You're wishing. Uh, I'm wishing. To, for more sales. It sounds like ka-ching, doesn't oh, it? Oh, ka-ching. <laughs> Subconsciously, you're wishing for more eBay sales. Yeah. Right. right. Shall we do it then? Let's do it. So you're as far right. over as you can go. Yeah. Touching woman, love. Touching wood. Touching wood. Big old clump of hair. <sighs> I know I spent all winter moaning about it being cold. <laughs> but it's not even got hot, hot yet, and I'm, I'm already over it. You know when you're like... Mm, mm. <laughs> it's warm today, isn't it? It is warm today. It doesn't help that you've got these lights going no, on. No, that's probably it then. Um, and we're drinking coffee. And we're drinking coffee, I mean... But I'm already thinking, oh, I'm not loving the summer. <laughs> it's like day one of it being warm. Right, should we do it then? Let's quick stick, quick quiver there. Quick stick. <laughs> That's a good start. I can't do that, I can't down it. Chug, chug, chug. Mm -hmm. There you go, I'm done. Really? Mm-hmm. Well, Let's do off, it. Coffee off my face. <clears throat> We're done. It's always nice when it's finished. <sighs> and relax. And relax. 